The Comica CVM WM200 wireless microphone system is for DSLRs and professional video cameras. Comica offers several different packages of their microphones, but the one I have here is the single microphone kit. It comes in a hard case similar to a Pelican case with foam cutouts to keep the gear from moving around. The actual transmitter and receiver units are made of metal, which I was really happy to see. Of course, the receiver has output the camera, plus it adds headphone monitoring, which is actually really nice to see. And on the transmitter, it has one microphone input for the included lavalier. I was also really happy to see that it comes with a battery tray similar to what I've seen on Sony systems. Comica's microphone packages are actually two microphone systems, and the receiver allows you to select input A or B, or you can select both A and B depending on whether you have one or two transmitters. The individual transmitter can also be set to A or B also. Both the transmitter and receiver has a quarter 20 mounting hole on the back for accessories like a hot shoe mount. And mounting the receiver on top of my camera looks right at home. To get the signal to the camera, just plug in the short 3.5 millimeter aux cable and twist it in for a secure lock. Then hold down the power button for two seconds to turn it on. Do the same on the transmitter and the LCD lights up. The microphone cable also has the same screw lock to prevent it from being pulled out accidentally. And when the units are talking to each other, there'll be a green light on the receiver. As you can see here, I only have input on the A side. The lavalier itself is small in size, but I've worked with smaller lavs, and the metal clip seems pretty sturdy like others I've used. There's also visual confirmation on the LCD when the audio signal is detected. But if you happen to get static or a bad signal, you can switch with up to 96 channels to find the clearest one. And I also like that the transmitter input can be switched between mic and line level inputs. Inside the package, it comes with an XLR cable, two hot shoe mounts, a dead cat for the mic, and a belt clip that I forgot was still in the carrying case. But for now, let's get into some audio examples with the Comica mic recorded indoors and outdoors on my DSLR. Here we go. Okay, so this is a quick test of the microphone. I'm standing about 15 feet away from the camera in a large conference room. I'm holding the mic approximately six inches from my face, and I'm talking out of the normal voice. Uh, again, this is a large conference room. I'm using the Comica wireless lavalier system, and this is a test indoors inside a conference room. And let's go outdoors right now and take a listen. Okay, so here I am outdoors with the Comica mic doing an outdoor test. I'm about four floors up on a balcony with some busy streets down below me. There's definitely some traffic noise down there. I'm not sure if you can hear that uh, or how clearly my voice is right now, but there's definitely some cars down below me and um, there's a pretty major street down below, but uh, at least you can hear what this sounds like outdoors um, using my DSLR. As far as mics go, I'm very happy with the Comica CVM WM200. What I have here is the one mic kit, but you can add a second lavalier transmitter, or Comica even has a wireless stick mic that you can use for the B input depending on your needs. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'm getting close to reaching my 10,000 subscriber goal, so please hit the subscribe button so you won't miss any of my weekly videos. Thanks for watching.